I feel it was a very good thing I did by coming to shelter. And if I had to do it all over again, I would. Because I feel that this was a life-changing experience. We called the women's safe house. Within a minute, staff called me back. In her voice, I heard her concern. She was my angel. I personally believe that God places people in each other's lives at the perfect time for a certain season and purpose. The women's safe house was truly guardian angels. I came from that terrible, terrible relationship. I live alone except for the dogs. I am alive and safe because of the help from the Women's Safe House. God's peace and blessings to you all. I was nervous and scared very nervous and scared. I thought I was in love. I thought that's how guys supposed to show their affection. It was getting worse and worse to the point where I was not sleeping. I was afraid to go to sleep. He had been drinking and he went and got a knife from out of the kitchen and he pointed the knife at me and my daughter told him to get away from me. Then he turned to her with the knife. That was my breaking point. He knew I was leaving. I was thinking about leaving. So everything got stripped for me. Everything. He took my shoes. He took my money. I only got one change of clothes for the kids a day, you know, cause that way I couldn't leave. The last incident with the gun that made me realize it was enough. I ended up in the hospital over the, you know, the last fight we had or whatever, you know, and um, a social worker in there um, told me about it. Why am I in this predicament? Why God is punishing me? What did I do wrong? Why did I do this wrong? How can I get better? So I, I didn't feel good about myself at all. It makes me very hurt, depressed, sad even, more importantly, angry. I had to make that choice. It was either gonna be my life or or to get help. I chose my life and I don't, I have no regrets. <laughs> I felt peaceful when I got here. And I, I wasn't lonely, but I felt at ease. The staff has been fantastic with me. They, they have worked with me through my problems. They have helped me seek counseling and help for my children. I was still a little, you know, about coming here, but um, as soon as I got here, I, I, you know, I felt a little better and I feel better every day. From this point on, I'm still, you know, eager to go to the meetings. They're helping me a lot. Just to be in a place where you had other people that was dealing, even some of the staff here, you know, have had some of the same experiences with abuse. And they're letting it, me explain my side of everything which um, happened, which I thought it was always me, but it wasn't always me. I took a lot of courses here to help me with my self-esteem to get back, um, put myself first, um, time with my kids for parenting classes even cooking every day. <laughs> I start taking classes and I realize, you know, the classes really help. They, I mean, they just basically, I mean, let you know that there is help out there and it works. <laughs> it's pretty good for me to finally break down and know that I can come out of it. If you want to live, you have to live Starting right now, you gotta leave now. 
you know, because it's help out here for us. It's help, you know, but we have to want it. Until we're sick and tired of being sick and tired, nothing will change. Nothing will change. My short-term goals is to um, stay with the program and find a place to rent and just get out on my own two feet. And uh, that's a little scary because, you know, I've always, I've had been with him for, you know, a couple years. I have this organization with me, so it, that, it helps a lot. People should get involved with the Safe House to help because it helps women who can't help themselves at the moment. You know, it gives us strength, it gives us hope. It's just a way to save families, you know, women and children, because our children, they learn from us. If we don't have a place like this to come to, we will stay in the situation that we're in with the abuser. The Women's Safe House saved my life and my children's life. The Women's Safe House did that. They saved my life that night. They kept me in hiding for six weeks. The outreach program gave me a new life.